Hi, my name is Bob Flisser, author of Microsoft Office 2013 Getting Up to Speed for Total Training. A few days ago, a friend of mine asked me, what was my number one all-time favorite tip for Microsoft Word? So I want to give you the answer as well. And my favorite tip is an easy way of rearranging a bullet or numbered list. Let's take a look. Here's a numbered list of just some stupid stuff. And here's what most people would do. Let's say you want to take the fifth item and you want to put it up at the top. Most people will select the text, cut to the clipboard. Now you could press Control X or you could right click and cut and then go up here and press Enter to create some room. Go up here, press Control V to paste or right click and paste. Oops, now we have an extra line there. Let's backspace through a little bit. OK, it works, but there's a lot of fiddling around. And what if you needed to rearrange a whole bunch of these? That gets very tedious. So I'm going to show you an easier way. First, I'm going to undo. I'll press Control Z a bunch of times. And I'll select the same one. I'll click inside this number five. Notice I'm just clicking there. I don't have to highlight anything. Now on the keyboard, I'll press the Alt key, the Shift key. And with Alt and Shift held down, I'll tap the up arrow key a few times. And notice each time I tap the up arrow, the item moves up. Let's say I want to take number two and I want to move it down a little bit. Again, I'll just click in it and I'll press Alt and Shift. And with Alt and Shift held down, I'll tap the down arrow key a few times. Now this is a numbered list. If this were a bulleted list, let's change that here. So now it's a bullet list and it'll work the same way. I'll just take this third bullet item and Alt Shift and tap the down arrow key a few times. But wait, there's more. This works not just in bullet and numbered lists. This will also work in a table. I'll click this one. Now you notice that this table has banded rows and I simply selected the design from the table tool section. So I'll click in here and you notice that this guy is on the dark row and I'll press Alt Shift up arrow and I move him up and notice that the shading adjusts automatically. Or I'll take this person and Alt Shift down arrow and move that down in the table. And again, the shading adjusts. And not only does this tip work in bullet lists, numbered lists and tables, it works in regular paragraphs too. Let's scroll down here a little bit. Here's some random text. Let's say I want to take this paragraph and move it down a little bit. I'll click inside this paragraph. Again, I don't have to highlight anything. And Alt Shift down arrow moves it down. I'll click in this paragraph and I'll press Alt Shift up arrow and it moves it up. That's a lot easier than cutting and pasting. And not only does this tip work in Microsoft Word, it also works in Microsoft PowerPoint. Here I have a PowerPoint slide and I'll click in, let's say the third bullet here, and I'll also press Alt Shift up arrow. That moves it up. I'll click in this one here, Alt Shift down arrow. That moves it down. And yes, I'm using Word 2013, but this tip works in every version of Microsoft Word. So even if you have an older version, this is going to work. Go give it a try.